Hello everyone. In this session, we are going to discuss about display time with different time zones. I mean, uh, I want to display uh, New York time. I want to display London time. I want to display uh, the current time of India. I want to display the time of Australia like this. So, how can we display all these times at a time, but by using different time zones? Right. In our JavaScript data object, we have a method called to local string. And this method having some of the parameters, guys. I will show you the parameters available in this method here. So these are the some parameters we can pass to that method to get the desired output, guys. But here I don't want date style, time style, and all, guys. Here just I want to get the time style and our cycle. Just our cycle H11 means H12, H23, H24, 24 hours format. a uh, 12 hours format in the same manner time style is full long medium and short if it is a short means just we will get the time like this 10:40 or 10:30 pm or am just it is if it is a medium it will add the seconds as well 10:30 and it is going to get the time if it is a long means it will add the time time zone that is ist or something like this also it is going to add that we will see in a minute right so here and date style is not required just i want to display the times and the time should be in running mode right by using set interval method we can make them to run so let us see how can we start the same example yes guys first of all let me create some divs here with the different countries so that it is easy to us so to manipulate the thing so let us have a class uh class equal to let me take this as a time block or time box whatever it may be so like this i want to take four uh, boxes uh for uh four uh, different cities here okay let us go here let me have some heading called india so first we are going to display india time if this is uh, okay then we can go with the other nothing but simply it is copy paste if you are able to understand how can we get one country time then remaining all are going to be easy. just we have to change one parameter that is nothing but the time zone parameter okay let me take a paragraph in the same here paragraph let me have an id here so this id is going to be india time something like this you can take any id here so india time is my id so whatever the time you are calculating please append the time to this div that's it and you can see the output of this page also and refresh it we have something called india and here paragraph tag is empty we have to calculate the time and we have to display the time here dynamically let us see the same here so now in javascript i want to append the time to it guys actually we have a method called in the date object called to local string l o c a l e to local string is a method in this we can pass some parameters guys first parameter is nothing but e n u s you can take any parameters here uh, e n u s or u k something like this some different parameters so we can take it here guys wait for a minute i will show you all the list of supported parameters here the first parameter here and the second parameter is the parameters which i shown you here these are the some parameters we have to pass date style as well as uh, time zone also one of the important parameter i missed here the time zone parameter i didn't i mentioned here i didn't mention here so one more parameter he is called time zone so this is the time zone parameter in this time zone we have to mention the name of the valid time zone identifier so means nothing but is asia calcutta america new york and uh, australia slash brisbane or sydney so something like this we need some cities right so we can google and we will find the list of supported time zones here right wait for a minute let me show you the first parameter is here e n u s something like so we can pass some different parameters here so let me show you the first parameter supported things guys please check here these are the some uh, codes of countries guys here a r s a and uh, bangla and every country we know that some codes there right so some different different people e n u s right so here you, you can see e n z a south africa u n u s u n n z u n i n english right something like this no problem we can take e n u s for everybody or else based on the situations you want to take yes you can take it also no problem right e n u s here we have to take an object here to pass these parameters i showed you some parameters time zone and date style and time uh, hour circle everything is going to be an object 
object parameters here object here i'm taking this as a time zone is the first parameter in this time zone i need to give this as a asia slash kolkata k o l k a t a kolkata after that i want to go with the time style guys the next parameter is here time style what is the time style parameter i want to take i mean i want to show you both guys here let me take the time style parameter as medium i want to display with the seconds also right here the parameter is time style and the value is going to be uh, medium m e d i u m medium is a parameter and one more parameter here called hours a cycle hours are hour let us check it carefully so this is going to be our cycle our cycle is you want to display 24 hours format yes you can display 24 hours format otherwise it is going to be take the current time of your system guys this is our cycle and this is going to be h24 let me display this as a 24 hours format right so we are in very very morning i think so we have to check it which country was in 24 hours format now right so let us check it guys right so this is what guys now you can check it and just take it into a variable guys all of you check it just let me print this so that we will understand exactly what is the value we can see inside of it can you see here console.log of x just i'm printing it and refresh the page here now if you can refresh the page in the console you can check you can see the output of uh, uh, the india so this is 645 59 this is what the time we are getting for example if you are giving here medium short short if we can give here then you can see the time is different here can you see 646 something like we are getting and if you want uh, time style and long if you can give the parameter will be some different parameter guys here there you can see gmt mean which and if i can give full and you will get the standard also indian standard time some such a manner i am thinking so there you can see it is getting indian standard time and all so right now we don't want all these things here just give the parameter medium just i want to display time with seconds with running mode that's enough right for me right this is what exactly the thing see please try to append this time to this paragraph tag so we have already a paragraph tag here so to this let me append to it guys I uh, let me get it here document dot get element by ID so just I capital here ID what is the ID of it India time this is the ID I have India time India time to this we need to append so we have to use the property called inner HTML equal to that's enough guys so now you can check it so the time of india is going to be appended to the thing this is what exactly appended so now let me keep it into your function so what i want to do uh, i want to run this function f uh, for every second so that time will be uh, look like it is going to running so let me take it into a function whatever the code i written here let me keep this into a function or else var take a variable here variable function get India time this is what the function I am taking so we know that right so variable as a function we already seen the functions list and f u n city by n function as we can call the function like this also just to pass the code inside of it that's enough so how can I call this guys now if we refresh can I get output no you have to call the function get the function here just I'm calling the function and check it now you can see the output will be appended on the thing but this function should be called for every particular interval of time so what i want to do here so let me call the function set interval interval of the function name here what is the function name get india time comma and every second for every second i'm calling this now you can see the time was in running mode that's enough right so now it is running 648 41 42 something like that. in the same manner what i want to do let me have one more div here right here i'm going to take one more div uh, now i want to take the london time l o n d o n t i m e london time so and change this also london l o n d o n london or else here you want to take any city yes you can take a city as well that is your choice completely so this is what the same story what we have written for the above we have to write it guys here check it carefully your task is almost done and let us see it carefully here the function is get let me write a function here get london time l o n d o n london time here also you can call the function as london time 
this is also london time Hi, id we change it right this is london time right now here it is going to be changed as a time zone only thing nothing we don't want to go for anything u u r o p e sorry one minute where is the time changing here right here it is coming right u u r o p e europe slash l o n d o n london now you can check it so this function is also calling for every a uh, second guys now it is not appended so but here the paragraph id what is the paragraph id we have to take guys here id of the paragraph tag is going to be london time that's it so id you can change just the only thing now if you can refresh it this is the london time early morning and this is india time now so uh, this is not early morning there's um, 220 am this is the morning we have 650 here in the same manner i want to take one more div here the div is going to be uh america let us take this america div so time box new york let me take the city has new york here new york so this is going to be new york time as guys repeat the same job here i am copy pasting just i will repeat the same i just copied the code here and we have to change the time zone guys just you can change the time zone here that's enough right this is going to be id new york time here the time is here america slash new york a m e r i c a america slash new york y o r k it will come like this america slash new york underscore it will come and let me check it what is the time of america right now it is can you see it is 24 hours format now the time is here 21 22 pm but they are still we are the my system date is 20th may but their date is still 19th may so they are one some hours difference is there between new york and india and london right so now i want to see the time of australia let me go and copy paste the same div here so australia is before us i think so the time may be 12 pm or somewhere around i'm thinking so this is going to be uh, let us take the city as sy dnyy sydney so this is going to be sydney time and let us repeat the same job guys what we did for the earlier here the time zone for sydney is here australia is the time zone e u s t r a l i a australia slash S Y D N E Y Sydney. Okay, let me check it. The time of Sydney right now, and we are appending the time to the Sydney due. So now, can you see the time of Australia is eleven twenty three? This is P M, I think. Sorry, A M, right? Eleven twenty three A M. Our time is six fifty three A M. Their time is eleven twenty three. Some hours difference is there between Australia and the, this is what how we can display the time zones, guys. Yes, if we want, we can design it also. let me do a very quick design here by based on the class time box here so i just want to write small design for this first of all concentrate on the functionality design is secondary for us so in javascript border radius 5 pixels i am giving and uh, some height and width also let me give here height uh, 100 pixels if required we can change the height as well or else you can take this as a 120 pixels right now width is also 120 pixels i am taking if required we can change them no problem right so that's it i'm thinking let me check it and we can write display inline block as well so that it is going to come side by side inline block this is what we are displaying inline block just refresh it and we can see the times is going to be something like this so this is going to be adjusted properly in the sense we have to write vertical and top right otherwise uh, we can increase the width here let me go and let me increase the width of it and this is going to be 180 and this is also going to be 180 let me check it so the height i am increasing height and width i am increasing and you can refresh it and this is what the information and uh, display all the information to the center here uh, time box right 
our class is here time box of uh, h1 tag comma time box of paragraph tag so let us take it something like this so that both should be into the center so text line center right now you can see if you want you can take some uh, color uh, what is this is uh, some background colors also for every box if you want yes you can take that too also that is going to fine so I'm refreshing paragraph sorry just a P and check it carefully now you can see all the times in the center now they are working as per their time zones guys India time as well as uh, London time as well as New York time as well as Sydney time right yes guys these are the methods we written to get the times of different different countries and all and we get the time and we append the time to the uh, particular dues and we just did a small design for this for better understanding of it right yes guys in the next session we will see and with some other examples guys here right thank you guys if you have any doubts please comment under the video section thank you all